Hey guys, my name is Katie and today I'm going to show you what I have in my university bag and yeah, let's go. So this is my bag. I actually don't know where this is from because it was a gift from my mom. Also, this thing on here was a gift. And before I'm gonna show you what I have in my bag, I just want to say so that you know I am a law student and obviously I don't have university right now because of the whole coronavirus situation, but I thought why not pretend like we're going to university and show you anyway. So this is what I would have if I would go to uni. So let's start. I mean, the most obvious one is my phone. I have the iPhone 6s Plus and yeah, I don't have the newest iPhone, I'm a few generations <laughs> behind and I just have this uh, ring, thing, ring thing here on the back and the case is from Amazon and I have it in rose gold. I'm just gonna leave my bag right here next to me. Second thing I have in my bag is my MacBook. I always have my MacBook with me when I'm going to uni. I have, I'm currently recording the voice like with the microphone because I can plug it in the camera. I know there's probably an easier way to do it, but haven't figured that out. So here is my, my MacBook Air. I have the older generation, so not the newest one, but I love it so much. It is my first MacBook and when I started studying law in 2017 I was really really questioning if I should get one because it was so expensive and I never had a Mac. I always had Windows so I was really scared that I wouldn't you know get the whole thing but honestly if you have an iPhone it makes your life so much easier and I highly recommend. I always take my MacBook with me. Um, I read all my class notes, like all my class notes on my MacBook, I never have paper with me, literally never, because our lectures are so fast. Like if you try writing with paper and a pen, I don't know how other people do that. And I'm like, I can't even keep up with my MacBook. But what I always bring with me are two pens, because we have this signature list, like, you know, to sign if we're there <laughs> and I just think it's a good idea to always have a pen with you. What I forgot, I have my laptop in this case here. I know it's dirty because I spilled water in my bag like the... I'm sure this happened to everyone but this case it's from Amazon and it really protects your laptop like you don't have to be scared that there is getting any water inside because when this happened to me my MacBook was completely fine so we always have it in this case. Um, the bag just has this zip thing here and then it has this little containers here and then it just has this huge open space. <laughs> But I love big bags for university. I don't know how people go there with small bags. Like, I have too much stuff to bring. <laughs> so, just some small things I'm bringing with me. I always have scrunchies. If I want to put my hair back, you know, when I'm eating or when I'm in class, I just I always have one with me. And then I just have some uh, chapstick. Chapstick? Chapstick, yeah. <laughs> And this is a German brand. I don't know where you can get it in the world. I have used it for years and I love it. Sorry, I just had to get up quickly. So if the angle is anything anywhere different, that's why. Um, what I wanted to say is I sometimes have a lipstick with me. This one is from Rimmel. It was this, can you see that? This Kate Moss edition, I think. I don't know if this is still a way still available or if it was limited edition it's in the number 42 oh, it doesn't really focus so but i usually don't wear lipstick at university just because i feel like it is such a struggle because i drink and eat and i don't like it i don't like to reapply so i usually just go for a chapstick but sometimes i have this with me this is also by the way what is on my lips right now and next I have my Tangle Teaser with me, just like to brush my hair, especially when it gets windy or something. And 
Then I also have my water bottle. I have this um, refillable water bottle. It is from Primark in this sippy bag. I don't know what it is called, you know, <laughs> what, what the sip is. I just have some tissues with me. You never know when you need tissues. Then I have my um, power bank with me, like where you can charge your phone on the go. And I also have my regular phone charger with me so I can charge when I'm in university. Then I have this USB stick. So what is this called in English? I'm not sure. Memory stick? I don't know. I always have this with me because if I want to print something, I need this one. And just some... Um, Think for headache or any other pain. Then we have this case here. It is from Primark. It is very sturdy and I love it. Unfortunately, it's falling apart and I don't think they have them anymore. But I just have my sunglasses in there. These ones are from Primark. As you can see, I like to shop at Primark and Amazon. And then I have my reading glasses. I just have them with me for the case that my contact lenses fall out fall out or that they or when they start hurting. So I don't wear them, just they're just for emergency reasons. I've had them for years and if you're wondering, these are by Prada. My mom bought me them way back in the day because now I wouldn't have them that, that much money. But I really love them. I should have tried them on. And then I have my wallet. It looks like it's Louis Vuitton, but it's fake. And yeah, then actually the last thing that I have is this little bag here. This is also from Primark. And I just keep small supplies in there. Oh, I forgot. Somewhere I have also... I should have mentioned it probably more in the beginning, but my key, obviously. <laughs> like my car key and for my apartment and I have this little dog on there. I just have some spray de deodorant in there. Um, does that happen to anyone else? Like when they keep things inside something and then they start rubbing off because this happens to me and look at this hand sanitizer. It looks so sad. Yeah, this is hand sanitizer. Uh, always have it with me. And so sorry. Chewing gum. <laughs> Why does it keep rubbing off? Does it only happen to me? Am I doing something wrong? I don't know. And then I just have some hand cream. This one is from Bath and Body Works. And what else do we have? Some wipes to clean my glasses. Um, a mirror. Didn't even know I had it in there. A nail file. Is that what it's called in English? I have no idea. And then I have this little thing here and I have tampons in there because you never know when you need them. And yeah, that's actually pretty much everything that I have in my university bag. So you can see it's not a lot. And some of you might be asking like, don't you have any makeup with you? And, and honestly, no, I don't have makeup with me. I don't know what I would bring. Like, I don't know what I would like to reapply. Like, I don't reapply my brows or my mascara or my foundation. So lipstick is pretty much all I have with me or chapstick and my hairbrush, my tangle teaser. Oh, I forgot something. My earbuds. Of course, I have earbuds with me. Like, how else do you survive? I don't know. I don't know. Especially when I'm in a train. And these are from Solo to Focus. And I have them from Amazon. They're just some random in ear buds. And I don't have any books with me because we don't need books in our lectures. Like we have PowerPoint or we get cases and then we just type them. I sometimes have my codex with me. This is one of my codex. Things. This is where the law is inside. They look inside. They're pretty much marked everywhere. <laughs> and if you're wondering, like, what I would bring if I study in the library, I would also 
um, bring my laptop charger. I would probably bring those over ear headphones because I prefer them for studying um, over the in ear buds. And I usually also take some some highlighters with me. I just choose the ones that I like the day before. And what I also always bring with me if I'm going to the library is post-it notes. So. Just if you wondered, I don't really study at the library. I don't like it. I can't concentrate. I love studying at home um, in my own comfort. That's pretty much everything that I have in my bag. I hope the lighting is okay. I hope the audio is okay. And I'm sorry if I kept looking in the viewfinder. I tried not to and I'm sorry if this really annoyed you. And yeah, I hope you really liked it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Please like it. It would help me a lot so that other people can find my videos too. And subscribe if you want to see more videos from me. I have a lot of ideas. I just need to figure out this whole filming situation and editing. Um, but yeah, I am open for all the recommendations. What do you want to see? And yeah, I hope I see you next time on my channel. Bye.